has solved a host of human problems by overcoming many of our limitations. Computers have multiplied the speed and accuracy of our minds. Television has given us eyes to see around the world, but not to see in the dark until now. These are night vision goggles provided by a company called CCS Communication Control. And because of them, and about 50 years of research, these goggles let us do what we could never do before, turn night into day. They work on the principle of light amplification. Even in what appears to be total darkness, some minute traces of light are nearly always present. These goggles can intensify that infinitesimal glow invisible to the naked eyes by a factor of 2,500 times. To prove it, we're going to place a lens similar to these on our camera. And now, I'll turn off the lights. I am now in almost total darkness. And now, we will turn on the special lens. You can see me. I can't even see my hand before my face. By putting on these goggles, however, I will also be able to penetrate the darkness, to peer into the shadows where a mysterious world hides from the eyes of man. In the Malay jungle, fireflies produce a display of spectacular precision. Hundreds of individual insects flash with perfect timing. Closer study with a night vision camera reveals that males flash double bars. Females show a single light. And that is how male and female fireflies find each other in the dark. Divers in the Caribbean use an image intensifying camera to investigate an intriguing phenomenon. The camera provides the clearest look yet at an unusually equipped creature, the flashlight fish. The eerie glow can be blinked on and off. To a hungry enemy, flashlight fish seem to appear and disappear. In the confusion they create, the fish get away. In Bristol, England, local residents are familiar with the cries of wild foxes prowling the city at night in search of food and shelter. Now, infrared cameras penetrate the darkness that usually hides the fox. The cameras have been placed outside this abandoned mansion and in its cellar. Because foxes spend most of their time out of sight, scientists until now have had to guess about many of their habits. For a few hours each night, British television carries the coverage live and Fox Watch is a hit. The foxes become nationally famous characters in a kind of wildlife soap opera. <laughs> Events have taken a dramatic but baffling turn. The cause of the quarrel is mysterious. The fight ends only when the male is driven out. The female seems bewildered by her own actions, which have left her as the seller's sole occupant, for the moment at least. Throughout Britain, people tune in night after night, wondering if the mystery will be resolved. The 
male remains in exile and then the answer is revealed the female had been pregnant it is as though she'd had time for nothing but the coming births now all her attention is devoted to her four pups The male returns with food for all, and this instinctive act reunites the pair. The long-term study of the fox's dark world has uncovered a complex and caring family life. Other night creatures face constant danger. A vast cave in Borneo is a grotesque 